Hey there everyone, this is Piper here and today we're going to be playing some Battlefield 2. So this is actually quite an old game and this game actually went down when the GameSpy servers no longer existed. So this game pretty much couldn't be played online or single player. And then recently a company or a group of volunteers under the, the website battlelog.co they actually restarted the game up again. And they got this game working online and to be honest I wasn't really expecting, this is the first time I've actually played Battlefield 2 in a good number of years. And this is the first time I've actually played it. So I was like, how many people are going to be playing, maybe it's a handful, a couple of hundred. And actually thousands of people are playing this online. So I am giving this a little bit of a go. This is called Operation Harvest. This is one of the expansion packs. Just try and get into this map, into this uh, flag before getting killed. Someone shooting me. So yeah, and this, this is actually free to play Battlefield 2. You actually had to pay for it in the past. But you can actually down this, download this for free off the website. Let's get into the tank. Come on. Oh shit, he just got me. So you can actually download this for free off battlelog.co website. If you've played Battlefield 2 in the past, you've been uh, reminiscing of old times. If you're new to Battlefield 2, then this is a great game to play. Again, it's free and a lot of players actually say this is the best battle Battlefield in the series. So... Again, this is like a 64 player map or server. Uh, again, very, very large map. It's almost like a, a proper battlefield. Got him there. And again, I, was, I wasn't really expecting many players to actually be playing this online. But thousands are playing thousands of players are playing every day and it's a really good game to play actually and again really well done to the uh, the volunteers at battlelog.co done a great job in getting this game back up and running again let's pick up this player get in so we're playing as the MEC shit so there's two sides in this map. I haven't actually played this map before. Two sides, MEC and United States Marine Corps. And the idea is cat flags. And the first team who actually gets to zero loses. We're capping this flag. Sniper over there though. Got hide from the sniper. There's a tank coming down over there on the north side. Thank God I've got the. Get him back. Oh, I just died there. So we managed to revive our teammate, but we actually got killed by the tank. But we held up the advance a little bit there. We took out one of the soldiers and we capped one of the flags. And it's basically just a case of the team who gets to the team who reaches zero first, which is basically from losing flags, they lose. So you want to really try and hold on to as many flags as possible. We're going to go over this bridge. I mean, I haven't actually played this map before. This is all new to me as well. Someone is shooting me. It's almost like Operation Market Garden. There's a lot of fields in this area. And we're going to go up here. I think they've got some sort of squad leader up here. Yeah, there they are. So there he is right there. They have an APC over there as well, just have to hold out for the artillery that's coming down. Get 
and defended the flag. So it looks like the map is three bases on the, the west side or the east side and three bases on the east side and we've both got uncaps on either side. We're going to have to get some transport here and let's get it back across the bridge. So we're in Team Foxtrot. Got the other kill on that guy, he's come straight across the bridge. And we're gonna go oh ran into the lamppost there. So it looks like there's some train tracks here. We're gonna go across. Where do we wanna go? We wanna go left to get the other flag. I know there's a lot of tanks up here. So I drove up here last time. Shit, there's a tank, so I'm gonna run to the forest or the grass and hide. Tank should be just up there. There's a tank there. Shit. Oh shit, he got me. That's okay. So we're gonna hold on to try and hold on to these flags there. We're gonna go for the the large produce farm next. Again, these these aren't the vanilla maps on Battlefield 2. These are actually from the expansion. But like I was saying before, if you download this off the Battlelog.co website, you get everything for free. And I'm actually playing on low, low graphics because my graphics card isn't the best and I like to have a fast running game. But you can actually set this game to high graphics, set everything to high and the graphics are much better. Obviously the the game is over 10 years old now and it doesn't have the same graphics as modern games. Let's get the big gun. But again, it plays the best out of all the games. He's behind that haven. Oh shit! He got he just got taken out there by the the tank with the the vehicle. Again, you can use a lot of the vehicles as weapons as well. But it appears to be we're doing pretty well on this map. We've actually brought down the score to level now. Shit. They've got a tank right there. I'm gonna spawn back as anti-tank again. I might actually spawn as engineer and place some mines on the bridge. But I think we need to really defend the checkpoint uh, barn door. Let's get a couple of missile shots in there. There it is right there. Not going to escape. Got him again. He might actually shoot back because I'm the defilate. Get up there. So that's that tank gone. Do you have another tank on the other side? Again, this is actually a pretty cool map actually. It's got kind of a World War II feel about it with the, the fields. There should be a tank over there. I think the tank's behind the, the trees. Yeah, there it is. Oh shit, he got me. So again, literally thousands of players are playing Battlefield 2 on the Battlelog.co servers now. I think it was uh, a couple of hundred, grew up to a couple of thousand, and it's basically growing a lot now because this game is one of the most popular games uh, back in the day five or six years ago and then obviously the game spy server is shut down and a lot of players are a bit angry that nothing was done about saving this game and then the players got together and brought this game back online so we're gonna advance with this group might actually join another group or another squad we're going to advance with these guys and make our way to checkpoint barn door. But they're blowing the bridge. So we're going to have to either repair the bridge or swim across. So I'm going to swim across. Then I'm going to spawn back is probably... I'd like to go sniper. To be honest. But there is a lot of armour in this map. 
it's probably better I go as anti-tank and have the helicopter as well to spot that. And the transport helicopter. So we've got the UAV on us, which is not good. It means that the enemy can spot where we are. And it's UVA like in Call of Duty, but again, Battlefield 2 is much better than Call of Duty. Shit. Got taken out there. So we're going to repair the bridge. So he's actually revived. So the good thing about Battlefield 2 is it's a team game. So you have medics and different support classes. This guy just come going to run down here. Any second. Tank is right up there. Shit. Fuck. So squad two are doing really well. They've actually crossed the river and the squad leader actually died. But they did actually get a couple of men across. So we're going to have to... We are going to have to repair the bridge. Because we need to get across. It appears to be we're actually losing. So we need to cap another flag. So unless we can get across the, the bridge head. Or the, the bridge. We're going to lose this game. Shit. We saw that tank shell coming in there. We were too close to the, ta the tank. The tank exploded. And it actually caught us. So we are seem to be losing points. It, I think it might have been about all square or they were just ahead. And then the bridge was blown. So the bridge is back up and running now. Somebody repaired the bridge. So good job. Let's see if I can... Okay, I'm going to go in the APC. This is a little trick here. I'm in the APC. So basically... I can repair the tank uh, whilst we're actually in the APC because I'm engineer. So if you have two armors together, one get, you both go engineer, you can repair each other and it's, a, it's not really a glitch but today we are actually repairing the tank there and we're actually benefiting ourselves from the protection. So squad 2 are doing really well. I might actually invite some players to join the squad that I'm in. It means that they can actually spawn at the front lines. Well, we're just going to sit here. So somebody's actually over there in the field. Might be able to actually shoot them. Let's repair him. Don't go anywhere. So we're going to go behind him just in case we get shot. We're going to repair this APC. And then hopefully we can start capping the flags. So we've actually got some of the, the points back actually. Fuck. And basically what happened there was they fired the, the helicopter TV guided missile at us. Which can take you out in a one -er. So we actually died there. But it's not the end of the world. We're going to respawn back in. So again, they're blowing the bridge again. We're going to go down to the bridgehead. And we're going to repair it. So they've got some sort of... Okay, they've got a tank over there, it looks like. That's firing down. So we're going to take the risky strategy run across. So there's a tank spotted. We're going to try... Shit! So they've actually got the APC on our side of the map. We're going to try and go for that uh, bridge over there. We need to seriously try and get across this bridge to the other side. Because I don't think we're going to win this if we can cap another flag. So I'm going to try and pick up some armour using this anti-tank weapon. There's one over there. That's, that's our guy. We're going to run over to this other bridge. So that's our guy, that's our tank. So they repaired the bridge. There's an APC right down here. 
and some just fired a rock at me. Fuck, he got me. But we're doing good here. I'm going to join Squad Alpha next. Because they're making real efforts trying to get across the, the bridge. And it's quite a stalemate, actually. quite a good map. Let's get into this APC. And again, they've got a really good helicopter gunner. Right, I want to take out this APC guy who's actually down here. We're going to go across here. We killed him before he could actually blow the bridge up. That was good for us there. He was going to blow the bridge. So we've actually stopped the bridge getting destroyed again. But they've got three fucking tanks. And they've got a sniper to the left hand side. Oh, he got me. So the sniper must have been pretty close there. Again, we're going to go anti-tank. We're only 20 behind. We can still do this. But they're defending the bridge very well. Let's run over here. Let's get into this vehicle. Let's see if we can pick anyone up. Get away. So we're going to try the other side of the map. See if we can get over here. So we can actually... Right, we're going to have to use the road to get around. There's an entrance right there. Wonder if they have mined the bridge. I'm going to run over it. There's a, the helicopter. Shit. So you got the helicopter there. Don't think there's anyone else there. And there's the tank that's right over there. Shit. So we drove too far into the lake there. I didn't realise that was so deep. But thankfully there is another vehicle right there. And we've got two tanks. We've got a tank in our right hand side, just behind. Got an anti aircraft vehicles. Oh shit! They drove into those mines. And he might actually shoot us. We're just going to try and drive away from the tanks, hopefully. So we've actually broken through there. We're going to go for the hilltop over overlook. See if we can cap a flag up here. Get the, get the base that we need. Fuck! So we killed two of the guys, but the other guy actually jumped out. So we're a little bit behind still in this map. We did a good job there driving all around, all the way around. That appears to be the best way because they keep on blowing up the bridge and we can't get across. And they know that unless we get across we can't win. And the guy's just done an artillery strike on our position there. So again it's almost like a... Not a real battlefield, but you've got the, the infantry, you've got the armour, you've got the aircraft, and you have the commander as well that can fire artillery, use the UAV. 
And you can drive around in vehicles as well. Shit. Almost running off the road. I'm gonna drive around here. Drive over here. Oh no, don't do that again. Shit, almost died again. So there's some guy over here, probably the snipers over here. Dead. Uh, I think the helicopter's coming over. Yep, it's the helicopter. So they've got a really good helicopter team. Let's spot the helicopter. There's some enemy over there. I didn't see any blue there. It's definitely enemy. Almost died there. But again, unless we can actually break through, don't really have a chance at winning. Can't hit that. Nope, too far away. But yeah, it's a pretty epic map actually. Operation Harvest it's called. And they've blown the bridge again. It's probably going to shoot me here. I am the best commander, thanks all. Yeah, he is actually pretty good. He's the enemy side. Shit, and he got me. That's pretty much game over, to be honest. Uh, we weren't actually able to cross the bridge. We actually did well at the start. The enemy side have got a really good uh, chopper gunner team. And they've done a lot of damage. So if it wasn't for that guy who got 43 kills, 36 kills, 33 kills, probably would have had a much better shot at winning this. But again, this is just a bit of fun. This is just a demonstration of Battlefield 2. Online, still very playable. Still many players are playing this online. Uh, usually about 4,000 are playing online. So definitely download this it's a it's free after all it's a great game again great multiplayer game you don't have to have an amazing pc to run it it's over 10 years old this game and you can see the graphics aren't the best but the gameplay is absolutely fantastic so i'll leave a link in the description to the website it's about 30 minutes to download well worth it check it out thank you for watching this game stay tuned for more videos don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. This is Piper signing off.